Now, the ABC Action News Sunday Sports Desk. Kyle Berger working from home, which means the wife thinks I have all this time to fix this leaky sink, but... While she's not looking, I do have time to tell you about some sports news. The NFL released its schedule on Thursday, and what a start for the Tom Brady era in Tampa. The Buccaneers open up the season week one at the New Orleans Saints. The teams will meet again in week nine in Tampa on Sunday night football. This rivalry has a lot of bad blood over the years. Then to spice it up, the guy Brady replaced a quarterback, Jameis Winston. Well, he joined the New Orleans Saints. But it's just going to be heightened. Uh, you know, they coming into Ray J, it's going to be, it's not going to be the same. You feel me? I feel like, you know, we're going to pack out the stadiums and, you know, the, it's not going to be an away game or whatever for, uh, for us at home. And, you know, we packing it in. And, you know, in terms of Jameis, I feel like, you know, I'm happy for him. It's great for him. The Bucks will play five primetime games this year. That's the most in club history. For the Tampa Bay Rays, plans to start play are tightening up. It's been reported that Major League Baseball will pitch its plan to owners this week. Now that plan is said to be an 80 game season that begins in July. Rays catcher Mike Zunino says when they get the okay to return to play, it might take a few extra weeks to get in game shape. You know, my biggest concern, honestly, with, with my position and stuff is the pitchers. You know, I want those guys, especially with you know, how we're built. Um, I want those guys to be ready to go right away. And, uh, you know, the, the biggest worries is, is, uh, is, is injury. You know, hopefully a few weeks is enough, but uh, I think we'll have to be smart as season opens to, uh, you know, keep guys fresh. The Korean baseball organization returned to play last week with no fans. Former Plant High School and Florida standout Preston Tucker, he plays for the Kia Tigers. He told me what the experience is like playing baseball during a pandemic. We have uh, these little por uh, portable uh, thermometers. We got to check them um, first thing in the morning and before we go to bed. Uh, if we're running a fever, we got to call the trainers. Um, they won't let us in the stadium until we clear like a, uh, like a thermal camera. And time now for your highlights from home. Bucks punter Matt Gay trying to get in a workout, but I'm not sure how much work is getting done with baby Oliver scooting around. We'll be right back. I'm Kyle Berger. You're watching ABC Action News.